I've been talking a lot yeah, today. I so know. now I'd like yeah, to ask Erika about her yeah. company security. Speaking of measures, yeah. let's first talk about personnel. What kind of initiatives do you have yeah. for personnel? Uh, yes, at our company, Kauai Tecmo Holdings, we have a department called Future Tech Basic. From the Future Tech West Department, uh, it involves the development of advanced game technology or game development itself. In addition to the development of advanced technology or tools, it's about security and security specialists are also involved. The security within the company, it's about making pathways and also as mentioned earlier, uh, we research and develop things like firewalls and what kind of software to implement. So there is a dedicated department. Is there special education available or a specific curriculum yes. for that? The curriculum or rather the experts who have been involved in security for many years. Uh, we have people who possess Kodos technology. So those people can train the juniors. And as was mentioned earlier, these security communities or seminars are being held in various places. Huh? Going to such places to get new information, we do it that way. Also in the game industry, security like that, a specialized organization for the game industry, the security organization for the game industry, talking about being outside. At the moment, I am informed about it. Yeah. It's mostly a situation where you have to work hard. The gaming the industry, uh, you know, has similarities uh, like having right, cheat prevention. Yes. So oh. I think each company is sharing information. So it would be nice to have software greetings like those specialized for the gaming industry. Yeah, that's, Hello, that's true. Yes. Uh, by the way, recently the topic changes a bit, but yeah, uh, like, we go through hi. the night. Hi, Jimmy, and that's you. where uh, DX comes hi. in. Oh. That's right. What kind of initiatives does Rikuhan's company have? Isn't our company already doing something like digital transformation? But digital transformation is specifically if you ask what our company does, even I still have unclear areas within myself, but in terms of our company, I think we should allocate. For example, in an online game, uh, this yeah. person might operate like this. I uh, think you were gathering a lot of information, yes. like what was bought yes. and various other it's details. It's about user behavior and so, trends, right? Yes. Such data is uh, being yes, utilized. Uh, of course, uh, how users interact with such things in the field. There are analysis tools for tracking things like purchases and they use that data. It can be used for the next update or the next new release. Well, um, this would be used as a reference. That's what we're doing in the game industry. Um, it used to be that you would make one piece of software and release it and that would be it. But nowadays, even after the release, keep updating it thoroughly. Using the internet, we update the software so home video games can be played for much longer. That update information is indeed available over the internet. We will do it. Recently, it's mobile games. Yeah. Uh, and then on the computer, there's internet gaming and such. Looking at what was open, we use the internet to update things constantly to keep them new. It is designed in such a way that uh, with new events and stories, users can keep having fun forever. Hey, you know, it was better back in the day, right? With the Famicom, you bought it, played it, and that was it. Now it's just constant updates. Yes, that's right. So as a creator, once you're done making one piece of software, you don't want to do a bad job. You want to make it in a way that people can enjoy for a long time. Yes, that is, um, it's really hard for the creators too. So it becomes a new way to enjoy games. It's not just over when you reach the ending. There's more beyond that. Huh? We're providing enjoyment in a way. We're able to offer our customers a new way to enjoy things. So it's very rewarding. Isn't huh? managing software important? Like I said. The biggest challenge is Definitely security. Yeah? It's also said that new information can be stolen and there's the well-known DDoS attack. 
Their servers are intensely yeah, targeted. Goodbye. Uh, hey, little bacho chan. That's really something that users find most annoying, isn't it? They want won't be able to, to do it. it. It will happen. But they can't. So it's obviously problematic to have data stolen. But other than that, well, isn't it your own problem? But it's not just that. There's also the risk of personal information getting exposed or not being able to play and bothering the customer. Uh, isn't that more important on that side? And how do we block that? Yeah. Uh, since we have to take care of this and protect that and protect this too, you mentioned earlier that we need to properly assess what needs to be protected. It's difficult. But it's really it's difficult, difficult you know. to truly... Uh... I asked about DX, but in yeah. a way, it seems DX is already progressing. Uh, that's uh, exactly Nowadays, it's true that it prominent companies is. are like that too. Convert paper yeah, to pdf I can't that's digitalization like that. oh it's in a phase okay. where we're going digital so yeah. probably the game industry will advance considerably yes we also need to be cautious our company until we enter this covid 19 pandemic really digitalization shifting from paper to digital hasn't been progressing much triggered by the coronavirus pandemic work from home from the moment I had to do it, I went from writing loosely on paper to digital. All at once, we're going digital. Good night. It was because of some trigger that things changed so drastically and in such a short time, you know. The COVID-19 pandemic was really tough, but it wasn't all bad, you know. Oh, yes, I stayed the it. current management is so? team is yeah, amazing. Totally. Uh, that's exactly how we want oh, security. Oh, there's no <laughs> I don't need it. Uh, security never ends. We must continue to protect it. It was said that it is a cycle of being protected and exposed repeatedly with no end in sight, even as a goal to study there is no end as a way to see through knowledge. Honestly, um, I can't keep up either. That's just too much right. information. Uh, mm. I thought I knew everything about security, but I actually didn't understand it at all. When I just joined the security committee, and then there's this thing called the honey. It's pot. amazing that it's all just fast. hearing the word. It sounds very delicious. <laughs> but when I when I knew so little ha, about ha, security, ha. Right, I thought honey pot had yeah, something to do with honey. I learned what honey pots really are. So there are there are various types of cyber attacks. You know, I keep learning different things. But then there's always something new, something new. Huh? I am thinking about studying more deeply. Knowledge just keeps coming out endlessly, doesn't it? It doesn't settle. Uh, the key points that you need to keep in mind are fully covered in today's video. Yes, it was uh, good. By really looking at this, you will know what you need to do and what you need to think about. The, there are things that must be kept secret. Uh, I think it turned out to be a very good video, don't I've you I've talked think? a lot, uh, so I'm uh, happy uh, if that's uh, the case. You? Well, uh, let's end it right, here. Thank you. No. Uh, we can't keep talking for too long here, so I'd like to wrap up. Thank you everyone for today. Thank you very much.